Miami's $4.2 million Bicentennial Park won't be completed for at least two to three weeks after the planned July 4th opening date. The reasons for the completion delay are, one, the disappearance of the park's architect, Julio Pestonite, and the late arrival of fountain and water sprinkler systems equipment. According to a spokesman for the M.R. Harrison Company, main contractors of the park project, Pestonite disappeared about two and a half months ago, leaving a dozen landscape workers without paychecks and only a third of the work completed on the park site. In the meantime, the Internal Revenue Service has placed seizure tags on two of three of Pestonite Company trucks still on the park property east of Biscayne Boulevard and south of the MacArthur Causeway. The Harrison firm has since taken over the landscaping project and retained most of Pestonite's former employees. Park planner Wayne Kaiser said the elaborate fountain system at the entrance won't be operational in time because of the late arrival of pumping equipment. The plans uh for completion of this park is uh, all on schedule with the exception of uh, some minor mechanical equipments that we're having problems with delivery dates on. What are those? Uh, these are pump equipments for our fountains, uh, some of our uh, e electrical equipment. Uh, they're just delay in ordering or coming from up north. What spectators may see here during the July 4th celebration are a fishing lagoon, restaurant, playground, artistic landscaping, and a bayfront overlook. C.T. Taylor, Channel 4 News.